Hello everyone, it's Shane Kanto, your Wasteland reviewer, and I'm here to review the new Showtime documentary from directors Martin Scorsese and David Tedeschi, Personality Crisis, One Night Only. And this documentary focuses on David Johansson, who is the lead singer of the New York Dolls, and here he's doing this live performance, but also Scorsese and Tedeschi are creating this documentary about him and his life, his career, his legacy, and what he has left in music. And the performance, it's a good performance. It's well shot. It's cool. It's in this small club, this jazz club, and he's dressed with the pompadour, the sunglasses, and just the suit, and it really captures the vibe of this performance, of this music, because he is playing a lot of jazz. Now, you're watching this, expecting Johansson coming out here and doing like New York Dolls type music, you don't get that. Now, a lot of the music I thought was cool, it was smooth, it was well done, but I didn't really feel connected as much with this music, and nothing really blew me away. It's also some choice lyrics that, the way that they're sung sound like they're trying to say something else. Particularly the first song in this documentary, which, if you watch it, you'll know what I mean. But this film, the concert film is well shot, it's engaging, it's a good performance. This isn't like The Last Waltz, and Shine a Light like has a lot of energy, but it's still the Rolling Stones decades past their prime. And you have this man who's not trying to be that New York doll, that man who dressed up in women's clothing and was very rebellious and rambunctious. He's a... Old, he's an older man now, and he is in a certain point of his career where he's experimenting and coming out here with new mu new kinds of music. And this show really captures that effort, and it's really well done. And then you have the documentary aspects, and we know Scorsese does great rock docs with George Harrison's Living in a Material World being just chef's kiss three and a half hours. This documentary is very informative. You hear from Johansson, you hear his perspective and what he was able to bring, his perspective on the world and what he brought to the New York Dolls and the influence that they had. You see how their music impacted people. You see how their style made a statement and shook things up in a time period where things weren't very well accepted in certain areas and not even today it's very well accepted either. So just doubling down on that and just hitting that level of engagement and just power with what his, this band's statements were, both from what they wore to what they sang about to what they performed. And this documentary is well done. The concert film is engaging, even if maybe the music isn't as like dynamic as Johansson's earlier works, but it's still a cool an interesting and well put together documentary slash concert film that captures a lot and you feel the passion of Scorsese in the life of Johansson and maybe he just really loves people who look like Mick Jagger. Just throwing that out there. But those are my thoughts on Personality Crisis One Night Only. Let me know what you think and let's talk some movies. But thank you as always for tuning in and supporting your Wasteland Reviewer.